Kane earlier today with a 6-0 win over Nick Olivero. For Tarantino, a perfect 2-0 and in duels so far this season. Won at 184. That was against Davidson. A 4-2 win over Wyatt Ferguson. And then last week, he jumped up and wrestled at 197 for Harvard and got an 8-4 win over Kale Black. The lone rematch from last year's duel between these two Kane earned the major decision over Tarantino, 21 to eight in that. A little over halfway through this first round. You can hear the Carolina bench encouraging Kane, saying, get after it, Gavin. Tarantino with a quick snap there. Trying to get in on the single leg of Kane. And he's going to get the takedown. Tarantino with the early lead. Kane will break free for the escape point. Tar Heels still have an opportunity in this duel, but they've got to win all three of these final meets, or final matches. And at least one of them have to come with a bonus point victory. So far, 33 and 41, the only weight classes the Tar Heels have won. A 7-4 win for Jace Palmer, and a 17-4 win for Lachlan McNeil. Only action in the first round is a Tarantino takedown. Tar Tarantino will be in the bottom position for this second round. Only built up 10 seconds of riding time after the first round takedown. And breaks free of Kane here, seven seconds into it. Kane yet to make a move on the offensive side of things here. Had no problem scoring against Tarantino last year. 21 points, and that was when takedowns were still only worth two.
couple of veteran wrestlers, Tarantino, a senior. Kane in his junior season. Just the one point on the escape here in round two. That goes to Tarantino. And he's going to take a lead over the 19th ranked Gavin Kane into the third round. Caution against Tarantino. <laughs> Out of the circle, we'll get a restart. Kane able to get to his feet twice there, but Tarantino doing a good job of sticking close to the body. Not allowing any separation. And again, Kane to his feet this time. He'll get the point on the escape. There's the first shot from Kane, stuffed by Tarantino. Minute 30 to go in the match. Kane realizing that clock's starting to run out, being a little bit more aggressive now in this third round. Stall warning against Tarantino, in on a shot on the counter. And he's going to get another takedown of Kane. 7-2 lead for Tarantino. And out of the circle, we'll get a restart with 52 on the clock. A win here from Tarantino would be huge for him individually, but also would lock up the team win in the duel. Kane with the escape. Down by four, though. He's got a lot of work to do with just 45 seconds remaining. Tarantino has done a great job defensively, stuffing every attempt from Kane. There's another stall warning. Kane will get a point. It's a three-point lead for Tarantino. 30 seconds, a little under that to go. Kane trying to work to get to that left leg, right on the edge of the circle, and they go out for a restart. 15 to go. Thirty-five seconds of riding time for Tarantino, so no extra point. And a caution against Tarantino on the quick start. Pause while they get the clock fixed here. Couple of attempts from Kane to go for that leg. Finally gets it. Can he get control? He does. Just three seconds left as he does. Holding on as the clock runs out. And we're going to have some extra wrestling. First to score wins. Tarantino had control of this one early. Kane battled back. Both wrestlers gassed at this point. Tarantino in on a single leg, trying to get around. And there's the three. Tarantino with the upset win over Kane in OT. Ten seven, the final. And it gives Harvard the win in the duel 
As they pick up three more points, they have a 20-7 lead over Carolina. Just two weight classes to go.